Time to turn things over to Carly for our first look at sports, Carly. And uh, we've got a pretty good relationship with the CPCA. We do a lot of coverage mm -hmm. on the uh, Chucks, and I guess we're going to get a little bit deeper now. You're going to be an outrider, is that right? Uh, yeah, I am. I'm going to give uh, former Bobcats uh, forward Kevin Deagle a run for his money. No, I won't be outriding, but I will be starting a new CPCA feature today called Inside the CPCA. Well, the Chucks might not be running in St. Wahlberg this weekend, but drivers and outriders will be hard at work preparing for the next stop on the Pro Tour, which comes next weekend in Yorkton. And today, this is the first edition of a brand new feature. As I mentioned, it is called Inside the CPCA. Now, some things run in the family. Blue eyes, dark hair, maybe even a signature laugh. Well, for CPCA rookie driver Chris Molly and his family from Chauvin, Alberta, horse racing is what brought and keeps his family together. Yes, that's how Wendy and I met, was through her brothers and her parents too, they horse race. Molly and his wife Wendy might be new to the CPCA Pro Tour this season, but for these two equine enthusiasts, the chance to work and travel with the ones they love means... Everything, yeah. We, we chose to do this as a family sport, um, meaning that um, if he goes, we all go. As the defending North American Pony Chuck Wagon champ, Molly is no stranger to success, and Wendy has been there every step of the way. I watch and I watch to see which one seems to be doing its job and which one doesn't and then he'll come and ask me and we kind of just, I don't know, have a conversation and feed off of each other in terms of which one belongs where and it's a good working relationship and it works well for us. It's wonderful to have, have her, she's watching every horse and where we should change it, put it and, and she's also an equine therapist too so that helps she can work on the horses at home or at the track if we get a sore one, so that's a big asset to the team, that's for sure. In his first event of the 2011 Pro Tour, Molly took penalties on two of three heats, but for this team, some goals can't be measured using numbers. Just for him to be able to do what he can do and what I know he can do. It's just been it's lots of work, but you know, it's, I wouldn't change nothing. Inside the CPCA, the view from the barn, the wagon bumps and from the track ignite your adrenaline Welcome back. Well, last night the weather put a bit of a damper on league play in the North Saskatchewan River Baseball League. The Unity and Lloydminster Midgets got rained out at the Legion Ballpark, but the Mervyn Flyers were able to improve their record to 3-1 with a 9-3 win over the Expos. North Sask play continues tonight. The Flyers will try and make it two in a row as they travel all the way to Kindersley. Uh, elsewhere, the Beavers host the Cardinals. The Redbirds from Unity are sitting on top of the league as they have yet to lose a game so far this season. The Beavers' tale, however, is the opposite. They head into tonight's matchup over two, still looking for their first win of the year. 